Chalet. Chalet. We'll take you to the limit. <laughs> video because recently I just felt the need that was compelling enough to show you guys my swimsuits. I know what compelled me to film this video. Literally, I think it was like last year or maybe even two years ago, my friend Maddie, if you guys know Madison Rose Beauty 1, she filmed a swimsuit collection video and I was like, someday when I am a YouTuber, I will film that too. So here I am. It is now extremely hot in California and I thought that I would show you my swimsuits. So before I start this video, I just wanted to clarify why I literally look like I'm going clubbing. Um, today, my friend Chelsea, she's actually here right now, and we were watching a bunch of YouTube tutorials on like smoky eyes, so we're like, okay, we're gonna attempt a smoky eye. So we did the whole thing, and this is how it turned out. I never do makeup like this, so I feel pretty cool right now. Mm. Let's like swim into this video. My hand is a dolphin. <laughs> suit is this one and this one is from Forever 21 and the cool thing about this swimsuit is that you can get it for like four dollars which is bueno bueno nacho have you ever seen Kim Possible bueno nacho yeah <laughs> go to bueno nacho to marido and a taco always going to sass one not I'm buying so this swimsuit is from Forever 21 and I love it just because it was super inexpensive so I just bought it one day but the one thing about this swimsuit is that it will not stay up on you so this is more of like a tanning swimsuit. If you ever wanted to go and like swim at the beach or in the pool, literally forget about it because this will slide right off of you and you will look like nobody wants to see that. But the cool thing about this swimsuit is that it does come with straps. So if you guys would like to, it comes with one strap that's just like a little halter. So you could wear it in the ocean, but the strap doesn't stay on that well. So long story short, just would definitely use this for tanning, but it's super cute and cheap. So you can buy like 20 of these. So along with that swimsuit, I like to wear this one from Forever 21. And this is more of like a bra type swimsuit. And this has no padding in it. I forgot to mention, this one doesn't have any padding in it. Well, it has like one like very thin pad just to kind of keep it in. But other than that, there's no like boob enhancing padding. So for this swimsuit, this one was $12 at Forever 21. It's so cool. It stays on you perfectly. And I also like to wear this underneath white like tank tops and it just looks like really tropical and beachy. And for the bottoms, I just wear the same pink ones that came with the other swimsuit. These are like $4 at Forever 21. And I like these because they stay on you really well, but they also have this like very flirty kind of like opening keyhole thing so yeah these look really cute together so then I have all of these ones from Target and the first one is this really adorable black one with this really cool kind of like bedazzled like Egyptian princess type of thing going on in the middle and this one came with black bottoms but I just didn't feel like they were that necessary to show you like a pair of black bottoms they're really simple I really like this one because okay funny story I was like doing wash and when I took this swimsuit out of the wash, this thing was like detached from it. And I was like, great, my swimsuit broke after like literally the first time of me wearing it. But then I realized that this actually detaches extremely simply. And so you guys can just wear this as like a plain black one. So if you ever need like a black bandeau, this could also double as it. And then also if you ever wanted to just wear it like it normally is, you just take this and then pop it back on. It's so easy. It's really easy to just slide back on. So this is kind of like a cool double use type of thing. And once again, I just wear those with black bottoms. And then I have one pair of bottoms from Target as well. And these ones are really cute. The inside is green and then the outside is floral. And these are really my only pair of like tie bottoms. Like, like this, it's like a little tie. This one is a ruched butt, which basically just means it kind of cinches in on the butt crack a little bit. <laughs> what? So I have another one from Target because if you guys couldn't tell, Target has some pretty cool bikinis and it is this one. And this one is kind of like a mint green blue kind of one. And it's covered with this really pretty lace that has flowers all over it. Yeah, 
I like this a lot. So then I have two swimsuits that I actually got from a Goodwill. I was like looking at a Goodwill this one day and I went to the swimsuit collection. I was just like thrift shopping and I saw some swimsuits and they actually have really cool swimsuits. I don't know if your guys' Goodwills do this, but mine by my school partners with Target. So all of the stuff that Target doesn't sell, they give to the Goodwill. And then the Goodwill sells it like literally unused, just like straight from Target, like all of their kind of overstock types of stuff. So this was a swimsuit that was from Target that Target never sold and I got it for like $3 at the Goodwill. So basically it's this padded like blue amazing bikini and it looks like something from Victoria's Secret, but it was not from Victoria's Secret, which is, you know, saving money. Saving money is a habit. It like me. Anyway, so this bikini is adorable and unfortunately it's a size large which looks a little bit weird on me but I can still make it work if I like absolutely have to have like a bikini, like everything is dirty. This still looks okay on me. This swimsuit, Target, got it from the Goodwill, saved some money, totally worth it. The next bathing suit that I got from the Goodwill is from, uh, uh, <laughs> I got this one from the Goodwill and the brand is Ella Moss, which I looked it up and it's actually a pretty nice brand. So I got kind of like lucky on this find, but this bikini was like $4 at the Goodwill. And basically it's this really cute, I think it goes this way. Um, it's kind of like this ruffle, uh, zigzaggy type of look. So it's dark blue. So I wear this with like black bottoms or you can really wear this with like any bottoms and it'll look good. It has a halter strap, but you can take it off and just wear it as a bralette or what do they call those? Bandos? bandos so you can wear it as a bando and it ties in the back and this is just a really nicely made kind of quality bikini that if you don't want to stand out and look like hey look at me I'm in a bikini this one's gonna still make you look cute but kind of you know keep you keep you under the radar with like the color so now I have all of these Instagram bikinis I'm gonna call them insta bikinis because everyone on Instagram and their mother has literally seen photos of girls wearing these bikinis so the first one is from Triangle Swimwear, and Triangle Swimwear is taking over the internet right now. And I never understood the hype about it until I got sent one, and the quality when I tried it on was really amazing, so I kind of realized why so many people are kind of jumping on this Triangle Swimwear train. It's very thick, it's not like stringy, it's not like weird or anything, it's gonna hold your butt in, so it's not gonna slip off of you or anything. And basically, I just got this in an orange color. It zips down the middle and then it buckles in the back, kind of like a little, little seat belt. So yeah, that is my triangle bikini. So then I got two bikinis from Gold Tag Swimwear, which is basically kind of the same neoprene type of fabric bathing suit as triangle. But the thing that I like about these are they have them in this color combination. Triangle, I don't know if they really have them in this kind of like pattern or I don't know what to call it, like shape, I guess. The triangle bikinis are a little bit different. These ones are just a little bit more geometric. So the first one that I got is green and I like this because it has a thicker back and it's just gonna keep you really nicely snug into this bikini so you're not gonna fall out of it, despite the fact that it is a bando. And then I also got it in blue. These are the blue bottoms and these are the green bottoms. And last but not least for my swimsuit, I have this one that is from Speedo, I believe. No, this is Nike. Not Speedo. This is definitely Nike. I got this one from Nike. I actually got this one from Big Five Sporting Goods. If you guys have Big Five near you, maybe you guys have a Dicks. Maybe you guys have a Sports Chalet. We'll take you to the limit. So I got this swimsuit when I was on the swim team in high school, and unfortunately, it was a little bit too big for me. So I never wear this because when you're on the swim team, apparently you want your swimsuits, swimsuits. Apparently, you want your swimsuits to be super tight on you to make you more like aerodynamic in the water. So this one was just way too big and loose for me. So I just wear this whenever I do laps in the pool and want to get a little bit more of a workout versus like a chill day. So those are all of my swimsuits and I hope you guys enjoyed this video and got some ideas on where you guys can find your swimsuits. Target is definitely a great place. Forever 21 for cheap ones that are still really cute with patterns and stuff. And then also if you guys have a Goodwill, 
try checking that out because a lot of times they have other stores donating swimsuits that are never used before so there's tons of them at least for me in California I don't know how they are for where you guys live but for me the Goodwill is a perfect place to find different kinds of bikinis make sure to follow me on Instagram and Twitter and Vine and my Facebook page and guys I'm almost at a hundred thousand Instagram followers so be sure to follow that because I only need like 3,000 more and it would be really cool if we could hit that so yeah go check that out so that's it for this video. I love you guys, and I look forward to reading your comments down below, and I'll see you guys later. Bye! I used to, I used to, yes, <laughs> that was good. I used that to play good. the Disney.com games all the time, and there's like Sweet Life, Zack and Cody, and then the Lilo and Ice Cream one. Yes. Yeah, and the Sweet Life, Zack and Cody, where you run through the hotel. Yeah, and you collect like coins. Yeah, and Mister Mosby could catch you. Yes, I'm still Mosby. Back on topic. <laughs> so that so, <laughs> make it rain. I make it rain on them. Shows, I'll make it rain. That didn't work! <laughs>